Hi everybody, this is Bupinder. This is a follow up from my previous video of how to use WhatsApp on your tablet as well as on your phone in a way you could use WhatsApp without having a SIM card. But many of my viewers have asked me that once they have closed WhatsApp, they can't reopen really WhatsApp from where they started. So I'm gonna explain in this video what you can do. Basically, you should not close the tab. You should not close your WhatsApp tab. And you should, in your Google Chrome, you should carry on doing other stuffs. Or you could allocate another browser just for using WhatsApp. Just follow the same technique that I've shown you in, in my previous video of how to use WhatsApp without a SIM card. You could do that in another browser and use that browser just for WhatsApp and leave that browser open all the time or if you're happy just leave that one tab in your browser allocated for WhatsApp don't close your Google Chrome or any browser you're using this can also be used in iPad it doesn't have to be Android so, so what you can do if you accidentally for example closed your Chrome first I want to show you that okay let's get away from this page I can't even close my tablet the tablet is not turned off I just close the tablet but now I open it again I go to the Chrome it was open already and if I go it's still working now I try to use WhatsApp on my PC because you can't use actually WhatsApp both on your tablet and on your PC as well as on your phone it can only be used in one place so if I use it on PC you will ask me to use it here then I say yes and now if I go back here back to Chrome it will say do you want to use it here it's because I have used it in my PC I'm gonna make another video of how you could use WhatsApp on your PC but for now if I say use here it logs in and it works but as soon as I close Chrome and I go to Chrome again it doesn't work anymore and it's so annoying so if this happens to you if you have come back to WhatsApp and it doesn't open what you got to do is to go three dots make sure your desktop is okay and when you click WhatsApp app it doesn't work it's so annoying so then you would need to repeat the process that I've shown in my previous video which would be somehow going to history then clear browser data make sure cookies and site data are checked and then clear and click on clear it will clear all the data from the beginning of time then you, you could go to whatsapp again so we go to whatsapp again just again make sure desk top site is checked and touch whatsapp app and unfortunately you here you would have to try to log in again from start in order to do that on your phone you need to be on the chat tab and then you need to touch the three dots and touch whatsapp app plus and just scan your barcode and then you're logged in just guys don't close for God's sake don't close your browser because then you will have a hard time coming back to your WhatsApp and you need to repeat this process it's not a complicated process but it's a faff it's something that we don't want to do so I hope I clarified now how you could use WhatsApp on your tablet without a sim card and to make sure you're able to continually use whatsapp if this video was useful please don't forget to subscribe and i got a tutorial on whatsapp you can follow that tutorial playlist from the description of this video and if you haven't watched my previous video on whatsapp how to use that on tablets i have explained more in detail how to do that you can watch the also description of this video i hope you enjoyed this video I hope to see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.